The power of programming. When Africa finally decides to invest in constructive thinking, we will be able to join the dots to conclude that the consistent failures of the modern African experience could only be a product of programming and nothing else. This will be the only plausible explanation for the colorless ambience of our African existence. We will never fracture the fractals of failure, except we put on our thinking caps to understand the math behind our enslavement program. Have you ever heard about the five monkey experiment program? This story illustrates how violence and pain can be used as tools for classical conditioning in human programming experiments. A group of five scientists placed five monkeys in a cage and in the middle a ladder with bananas on top. Every time a monkey went up the ladder, the scientists soaked the rest of the monkeys with ice cold water. After a while, every time a monkey would start up the ladder, the others would put it down and beat it up thoroughly. After a time, no monkey would dare try climbing the ladder, no matter how great the temptation. The scientists then decided to replace one of the monkeys, and the first thing that the new monkey did was to start to climb the ladder. Immediately, the others pulled him down and gave him the beating of his life. After several beatings, the new monkey learned never to go up the ladder again, even though there was no evident reason not to, aside from the beatings. The second monkey was substituted, and the same process occurred. The first monkey participated in the beating of the second monkey that was replaced. A third monkey was changed, and the same was repeated. The fourth monkey was changed, resulting in the same before the fifth was finally replaced as well. What was left was a group of five monkeys that, without ever having received a cold shower, continued to beat up any monkey who attempted to climb the ladder to get the bananas. Perhaps this will help us to understand why many Nigerians keep drinking tea, munching biscuits, and wearing suits in tropical heat more than 50 years after the exit of the colonial government. Has it ever occurred to you that the way we ape others, fight one another, do politics, religion, and even business is a product of programming? This story of Nigeria is no different from the 54 nations and 10 dependent territories of Africa. It's the same predictable home video with its terrible script and poor quality of production sprinkled with local content and flavors to distract us from detecting the expanding symmetry of Africa's fractals of failure.